Hi, my name is Captain Ryan Curcio. I'm here at Forty Keys Outfitters. Um, today, I'm going to be showing you how to do the improved blood knot. Um, it's the best knot so far for uh, a lighter line to a heavier line, such as a class tippet to a shock tippet. Um, it's a great knot for when you're connecting a bimini to a shock. Um, if you're fishing, you know, wire, you can use it that way as well. Um, but today, I'm just going to give you a 16 pound to a 60 pound demonstration. So we're going to take the light line, double it over. I go about six to eight inches. You can go up to 10, a little bit more. Pull that back out of the way. Take your 60 pound. Line them up like a standard blood knot. Heavier end this way, lighter end this way. We'll take the light end. We'll go up one, two, three, four, five. Come back, same way you did. One, two, three, four and we'll pass between the middle of the two, and we'll get that out of the way. So pull that up, out of the way. Come over with your heavy line. You go over one, two, three, pass through the middle, cinch down. And now you have figure eights on both sides. You pull it slow, and if they start to come up on that, little, you see how the tags are facing up, Separate them. Then you go nice and slow, even pull, and there it is. The next step here, we're going to go ahead and trim these tag ends down. If you look, the best thing about this knot is that there's an even height on both ends. So you have the 16 and the 6, you're going to be constantly pushing against each other. So what I do is I go ahead and trim it down. And with this knot, you can get very close, and you leave basically no tag. So it goes to the guides nice and easy. That's why it's a popular knot. So you're gonna have two ends left here from your double line. Obviously you wanna make sure you keep your standing line away from your tag. So what I do is I put one in my mouth. I'm gonna separate the other one. So I'll come up. And there you have it, improved blood knot. 16 pound to 60 pound.